kids are sleeping. I just cried for like 10 minutes. In the at this point, we're Disney adults. I found me. Hey, it's me. Good morning. I'm working on some UGC stuff today. I'm very excited to show you kind of like what I do. I have a couple of partnerships that I have to work on. Since this is my side gig, I do have to do it a lot of the times on the weekends. This is all to build my portfolio, so hopefully I can get better and bigger deals. I just woke up, as you can tell. My cat's crying, but we're gonna clean the apartment and get our whole space ready to film. Okay, this is the state of our room right now. It's still a work in progress. I want to fix up this room so I can make more videos, get some bedding, or do a partnership with them for UGC, so. Literally think it was just the bed that needed to be cleaned up. Okay, if you don't have the Octo Buddy, I definitely recommend it. It's like this sticky silicone thing that goes on the back of your phone. You can stick it anywhere on like a glass or like a mirror. I'm gonna do some double content here and film on my, excuse me, sir. I'm gonna do like an ASMR skincare routine. I already washed my face, but I'm doing it for the vibe. Of course, always 4K, 30 frames per second. That's perfect spot. <laughs> I definitely recommend playing around with angles as much as you can. That's what's gonna make a video really interesting. I took this course actually that I really loved, how to start and grow a YouTube channel. Honestly, I've taken so many social media classes and there's nothing that I've learned more than take in this one course that really inspired me to make really good videos. Not even for YouTube, but also for TikTok and Instagram Reels and all of it. It's just the art of storytelling is really hard to grab. So I definitely recommend checking that out. So let's go ahead and do my makeup. Yeah, that's fine. I usually like to test out the makeup I get before making a video about it, just so I can get a full rundown on how it works. So this is the Urban Decay Moon Dust. I don't know if this is new or they just like sent me it, but it looks really pretty and perfect for Halloween. Now this is a very glittery palette. I think I want to go for one of those like Asian Korean makeup. Eee, this is so cute. Go under right here and kind of emphasize the dark circles. this on my nose a little bit i'm loving this look okay then i got the scent this liner i'm gonna put this under the lash line right here because this is where she usually puts it i hope it doesn't burn because sometimes these burn it's not burning okay i don't know if i'm giving what i wanted to give i'm gonna go ahead and do some work i have some videos to edit and i have to plan out what videos i need to film today and tomorrow a lot of things i gotta do Okay, I just filmed me and Cade doing a partnership video with the Vive Immunity Boost Organics. I'm gonna go home and do the product close-ups, but for now I wanted to shoot it in the car on the go. There is a Phoenix vintage market right now and we're so excited we're gonna go check it out. Oh, did you guys spot it? That is in fact a parking ticket lady literally taking pictures of my plates. I just cried for like 10 minutes because I got a ticket. For context, I literally got pulled over two days ago for the same thing, <laughs> kind of upset. We're gonna make it better by getting a coffee. Okay, I got a cinnamon roll cold brew. I should've got oat milk. Plate doesn't hurt my tummy. Out of 10, how, what do you think? A six, honestly. A six out of 10. Oh, this one's only $10, sure. That's kinda cool. We're looking for Disney stuff. We found this gem. At this point, we're Disney adults. It's so cute though. Did that make me feel better? I don't know, I'm still upset that I have to pay $125. But let's go home and I'm gonna park my car and never drive it again, yay. I'm gonna shoot the product shoots now. I have the vibe. I think I wanna do like something in action. I'm gonna use the curtain as the background. I'm gonna use the background of this to kind of have like a clean face to film this. That's basically how I do a lot of my shots. I'm gonna drink my coffee and apply to some deals here. One of my goals is to get my Amazon storefront all set up. I 
have had it for actually a couple months and I have not made any sales. It's kind of just depressing, but I don't really push it. I just have it linked everywhere, but don't really buy stuff from me. So I think I just don't have really good stuff on there and I don't make videos about it. So I'm going to try to link a lot of good stuff that I find on Amazon because I actually do find a lot of stuff and I buy almost everything on Amazon. So hopefully people actually want to buy from me. <laughs> So I have like 12 to 14 platforms I use to apply to jobs, get jobs, and build my portfolio, all of that stuff. If you'd like me to share, I can make a whole separate video about it because honestly, it's a whole thing in and of itself. So I like to check these daily since honestly, new jobs come up every single day. And if you're the first one on there, they're more likely to respond back to you, especially if a good portfolio and stuff like that. I just posted a TikTok and I just featured my Urban Decay palette that I got. So I applied to a job and I needed to take a picture of my bedroom. I had a whole bunch of laundry in here. This is what I'm talking about. Like we are not gonna be able to get deals and stuff if my stuff isn't clean and like aesthetically pleasing because it's like the whole thing about the internet. going to Marshall's. Goal is to get some fall decor and um, bedding. Oh my gosh, there's like actually nothing here. And I really just want like a palm pillow. I can't find one. This one's cute. It's very Halloween though, and I want it to look like fall, not Halloween. So, oh, this is so cool. This section is honestly so tempting for me. Like, these flats are so cute. I'm using cash, so it's free. I'll do 24 and I'll do the rest of the part. Okay. Kind of disappointed with that Marshalls run, I'm not gonna lie. They're less than a dollar. That, that's a good combo, right? This is the pumpkin wool. And then these are the three pumpkins I'm gonna use to decorate this table right here. I also got this to decorate the table as well. This is the tray. And I'm gonna put these little chocolates in the tray. And then the orange mug. I got this because I thought it was cute for my skincare videos. I got this pumpkin brioche bread that looks so good. Um, these are cute, they're six dollars. I like this color, I feel like it'd be good. Something like that. This looks expensive. That's good. It's literally $30. Yeah. What is up with these Target shoes? Like, these look so fancy. They're literally Target. I have these in the nude, and they're so cute and comfortable. One of my favorite but more dangerous places I could be. Nords from Rack. They have such good holiday stuff here. All the Christmas stuff. They have so much Halloween stuff, which is exactly what I wanted. And unfortunately, I already got cups from Target. Like, look at these. These are so cute for some themed videos. I really want to do like one of these cookie cutters. Salt and pepper shakers, some cups, bowls, serving trays, tablecloth. Like, this is really cute. Pumpkins. I in fact did some damage. $220 later. I have four pairs of shoes. I got Cade some New Balance 550s. He loves these. But then I saw them for $60. They're so cute. I love these. I really wanted Adidas Sambas. They're sold out everywhere. And they're actually not Sambas, but they are very close. And these are it. They're literally so cute and they're exactly what I wanted. It's like a light gray. It actually matches my shirt right now. Fit me so well. They're a seven. The next one I got, I needed a new classic white shoe. I have some Reeboks. I've had them for about two years and they're really worn through. They're called BP Sony and they're these platform white classic shoes. I love shoes like these. I just get a refresh instead of like washing them because they just start to look really worn and it's not worth it. I'd rather get new ones. These were $30 and they were so cute and worth it. The last ones I have been looking for everywhere and I found me some Mary Janes. Um, they were this shiny leather and then they also had a more matte leather. I decided to go for these because just because they don't have any shoes of this texture. Love Nordstrom Rack. If you get there on a restock day, mm, you are lucky because you are getting some good stuff.
This is how the UGC video turned out. I love it. It's so full and Halloween. It's exactly what I wanted. So I'm very proud of myself for that. I have some other videos like the vibe that I still have to edit. So those will be coming soon. So definitely follow me on TikTok and Instagram to see those. This is the update on my bedroom. I added some lights and just organized it a little bit more. Hopefully I can use this to get more deals in the future. If you guys want to follow me along this journey of trying to be a content creator, hit that subscribe button and comment down below any questions related to UGC you have for me and answer them in the next one. Bye! Everybody.